Campus Safety Special Constable Service at the University of Toronto. Your call is being recorded for quality assurance. Please wait for the next available operator. Uh, hi there. Um, I have kind of a, 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 a weird issue that I got to call in about. Um, I am being harassed via posters that are being placed around U of T campus by someone called James Gillis. And um, the posters target me by using my picture, but not my name. And... Um, they actually use the name of Reg Hart, who this person typically targets in posters. And uh, he has a picture of me from when I uh, asked him once why he targets Reg Hart, basically. Um, okay. Do you know this person? I wouldn't say I know them. I've spoken to them, uh, I believe, twice. And they photographed me. They also, a, a third time, one time I arrived in the park in Kensington at Bellevue Square Park, and they were already there when I arrived, and they started photographing me, and I asked them, why are you photographing me? And they biked off. Um, they they sell used bikes as well, possibly stolen bikes, this guy, James Gillis. That's part of why he's involved in the postering situation. Uh, I'm involved in postering initially, originally, because I teach piano, so I've, if you've ever seen anarchist piano lessons, those are my posters. Uh, I studied piano at U of T originally. I live in Kensington right now. And, uh, so, so you're an alumni at U of T then? Well, I didn't quite graduate, graduate, but I'll come back and finish off a couple courses. <laughs> but, yeah, I, I'm a former student union president. Yeah, I, I was there for 10 yeah. years. I, I was there for 10 years, and I've been living in Kensington for 10 years, basically. Okay. T T What's your name, sir? Adam Golding. I ran for Ward 11, actually. Uh, 647-909-2109. That does not work. Um, for some, I'm calling you on Skype. For some reason, Microsoft shows people my old phone number. Um, I have a U.S. number, oh. but you can, that rings my laptop. So it's 870-630-2109. Uh, yep. And 4490. And, uh, I, I, if I can email you some pictures of these posters. Um, Reg Hart, who I'm not affiliated with, um, sent me pictures of, I mean, I've seen them, he's put them up before, so he's just, these posters, he's decided to put them up again, but James Gillis has decided to. Um, but, uh, uh, you, okay, I'll assign this to uh, Officer Adam, I'll get them to give you a call and see if we can be of any assistance to you. Okay, uh, do you want to take my email as well? Uh, sure. Sure. Yeah, so it's adamgolding at gmail.com, G-O-L-D-I-N-G. G-O-L-D-I-N-G? Yeah, and can you just send me an email now that I can reply to, and I'll send you some of these images. Okay, I'll assign this to an officer, and I'll have them reach out to you. Okay, and just, you know, I think something strange happened before that we, we basically... Um, we, we tried to charge James Gillis with harassment. The, the charge was, like, not processed or something, and I was going to have to refile it, and I didn't get around to it, and now I'm like, well, now I'm going to refile it, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not really sure where okay. it got caught up in the system. Uh, honestly, I think it's probably because people suspect Reg Hart, rightfully or wrongfully, of things independently. I've heard accusations about him that don't match what Dr. Jamie says. I think Dr. Jamie is just a troll who wants to bully the poster yeah, landscape, and that's independent of whatever Red Chart has done or not done, but um, I'm just caught in the fray because I'm also a posterer, so um, I would I would like to charge James Gillis with harassment. Okay, I'm going to have someone contact you this afternoon. Okay, thank you. All right, take care. Bye-bye.